and welcome back to the Social Stack 66 Day Challenge, Get Started in Social Media. I'm Amy Stack and today is day eight of our challenge. Today I'm going to show you how to create and pin a welcome post to your Facebook business page. Before I do that, if this is your first time here and you want to learn more about marketing and social media for business, go ahead and start right now by subscribing to my channel by clicking that red subscribe button and then click the bell icon so you don't miss a thing. The first thing we're going to do is write a post with details about your business and why people should like your page. You want to include information about what you'll share to your page and special updates and offers people might find there. So this will vary from business to business. After writing your welcome post, you can actually go ahead and pin it to the top of your page so that it's the first message people see when they come and visit. Uh, this is kind of a little spot to put a value proposition. It doesn't have to be a full introduction or bio, uh, just a little something to tease them. Um, and if you want to put more in there, that's fine as well. This is a good spot to put rules too. If you have any specific rules you want to share around your page, that comes in very handy in groups as well. Um, I do want to let you know I kind of prepared a little bit ahead of time. As you can see, we're back on the social stack page. I didn't want to put words in our friend Laura's mouth, so I'm using mine as an example instead. The first thing you do to get this started is go ahead and hit that create post button. And like I said, I had mine ready to go, so I'm just going to copy and paste my text in here. And I also made a little image to go with this, so I'm going to add that in. I'm just going to drag and drop it over. And remember, there's my little preview, that this is Facebook. You can come back and delete this or edit it in the future. So if you're not sure what to put in there, just put something small for now. And you can always come back and edit that same post or you can delete it or you can unpin it, make a new post, pin it to the top. You've got lots of options. You're not stuck with this just put something in there um, to put a, a little welcome to get people going. So that's one thing I haven't done yet. We'll add that right here. Oops. All right, so I've got my text in there. I've got my little video. And right now, to get started, we just want to hit post. And it'll take a second to load. Usually, if you reload the page, it'll pop right in for you. Let's give it another go. Oh, you know what? It's because I put a video in there. It takes a little longer to load. That's okay. So while we're waiting for that video to load in, I'm going to show you, you can pin any post that you want to. Uh, so while that video and post are loading up, I'm just going to show you how you can actually go ahead and pin something to your page. And you can go to any of your posts that you've already created. And you'll notice in the top right hand corner, there'll be three little dots, little radio buttons here. If I click on them, I'll get a new drop down menu. And you'll see near the bottom, there's a button that says pin to top of page. So I'll go ahead and show you what that looks like. We're going to go ahead and hit refresh again. And you see now this says pin post right at the top. And what that means is anybody that comes to this page will see this post first. So no matter what is going on, this is the first thing they'll see. It doesn't matter if you have newer content on there or not. And you can see that my video has loaded up in here. So I'm going to actually show you it now. If you want to take a pin post down, you click those three same buttons. Just hit unpin from top of page and that will go back into its chronological order on of your posts. So now you can see that wasn't the most recent thing I posted. This was. I'm going to go ahead and click my buttons again and go pin to page. That's it. That's all you have to do. So I'm going to refresh my page and we'll show you that that's back to the top and it will be listed as the pinned page. So what you need to do is come up with your post, 
If you want to add an image or a little video, you can do that and embed that right in there. I always suggest having at least an image, if, if not a video, to go with it. And click your little buttons once it loads and hit pin to page. I'm pinned right now, so if I want to take it off from being pinned, I just hit unpin. And that's it for today's challenge. So please remember to join me tomorrow for our next one. But before that, let me know in the comments what you want to include in your post. Let me know what your value proposition is and if you'll be adding a, an image or a video to your pinned post. Then go ahead and remember to like and subscribe and click that uh, bell icon so that you get alerts anytime a new video becomes available. I'll see you tomorrow.